now that we're you know into April, heading into May, is there anything you've seen in the last month that's kind of shifted from the previous quarter? Well, you know, being in this seat, I'm constantly looking at pendings. Our pendings were very, very low per agent. Um, the amount of the amount of agents we had, we should have had a lot more pendings in Q1. Um, so going into Q2, our pendings have went have went really high. Um, they should be higher, um, but what I am what I am seeing is that you know with interest rates going up a little bit, I think a lot of our conversations with our buyers are we, well, let's hurry up and get something yeah. and because we're getting I want to lock into a five percent before it goes to six or seven. Now will it go to six or seven? I don't think so, but you know it could and then the sellers are let's hurry up and get this on the market because I, you know if interest rates go to six or seven, I could lose some serious equity in my home. So we're seeing a, an uptick in Q in Q2, still a tough market. You have to battle and you have to really work hard for deals. But our our pendings have jumped by 150% in the last, you know, 45 days. 